One family's plea for answers today after this teen was found dead near a pond in Fort Bend County. The reward has now gone up to help find who is responsible for the death of Jason Montez. We've been following this story since last week when Montez's body was found in the area of Bel Air and FM 1464. Channel 2's Brandon Walker is now live with the latest on this investigation. Brandon. And Keith, there's no other way to describe how Montez's family feels other than desperate tonight, hoping someone may have answers to the question as to who killed Jason and why. First, I want to thank God for the privilege of being a part of Jason's life. Roxana Chacon's heart remains humble, yet shattered, left to remember her nephew, Jason Montez, killed. Jason was 17. Jason was always happy and smiling. He enjoyed every moment that we shared as a family. Family got word that Jason's body had been found in a retention pond last Thursday. Fort Bend County Sheriff's deputies responded to that call near Bel Air and FM 1464. Jason was shot. That investigators know it's who did it that remains the puzzler. We're still developing leads at this point. We do have uh, some very promising leads that we're working on right now. Jason's family says they last saw him the night before his body was recovered. He had stepped outside, we are told, to make a phone call. After that phone call the following morning, which is the 24th, is when the family noticed that he was missing. The family filed a missing persons report hours later, and later that day, they got word. My baby brother was just, was just 17 years old, and we want justice now, justice for Jason. We're grateful for everyone who has supported our family through these laws. We need your help, community. Please help. I think that speaks for itself. As far as that goes, Crime Stoppers offering a $15,000 reward for information that could lead to an arrest. More information about this investigation, Keith and Lauren. Investigators tell us that retention pond in the field where Montez's body was found is near George Bush High School where he attended. They also say that that area tends to be populated at times with teens who tend to do things that are problematic, but they still don't know why Miles was killed and what ultimately led up to his body being found there last Thursday. Anyone with information asked to give the Fort Bend County Sheriff's Office a call, also Crime Stoppers. We are live tonight. I'm Brandon Walker, KPRC Channel 2 News.